I feel like for the third 300th time this week, it's been, I'm gonna say, it's been a little bit of a week. A bit of a, bit, a, bit of a month. He's starting it and being like, oh, today is a new day, I'm gonna like vlog, but I actually cannot vlog what is happening because it is so mind numbing to myself. So I can't imagine what it would be like for someone else to watch that. Anyway, starting this off on a positive note. So I've decided to make some breakfast. Also picking up a vlog camera. I did it on a bit of a spur of the moment. Like I don't know if I need one. Basically had, um, you know when you look in your PayPal and you haven't, if you don't look, I don't know. Sometimes I don't look in there for ages. And I was like, oh my God, this camera is free girl math um, because I had the half or three quarters of the amount in there so I was like oh my god this camera is so cheap now I definitely will buy it um, I know that's not really how it should work but it worked out in my head so I'm gonna go pick that up from Argos anyway welcome come have breakfast with me I've also been getting quite like under the spot under the skin spots which I feel like is from the stress and probably hormones because like i just feel pain in my legs and that normally means you know i've got pcos but not the syndrome probably i'm getting this all wrong we don't have the full syndrome but they're just a little bit you have cysts sometimes and sometimes not so it's polycystic ish I have a numb leg, so I feel like I'm not taking care of myself, I'm not doing my normal things, and this is gonna be where I start. Anyway, got some tofu, avocado, kimchi, some tomato, and some spinach. Scrambled tofu. It's the ew, it's the easiest thing. Break it up. That's what it looks like. Some soy milk for. Bed bit of turmeric so normally have soy sauce but i've run out then some b12 i honestly just oh i just eyeball it nutritional yeast get all that nutrients i've put tomatoes and spinach in there i've got avocado and i'm gonna have some kimchi okay i've just added some seeds Bricky. Look how sweet this bag is. Basically, APC, they sent me, I'm going to show you later, really nice outfit. But whenever they send stuff, I think maybe, I wonder if you get this in the shop if you were to buy something, but they give you like such good bags. I've also got another one. Um, and now that's my new shopping bag. I've decided to sit on the sofa because I can't be asked to sit at the table. This is uh, Iger Grass. My sister told me about it because she was wearing it. She was like, oh, I'm not wearing concealer, I'm wearing tiger cloth. So it basically just, I think it also heals, oh, I think it's Korean, by Dr. Jan. And it's supposedly supposed to heal as well, but it basically just gets of the redness. It's working, like it's not covered. Wouldn't be able to, well, could, but not gonna go to like an event wearing this, but just for the day. I don't know. It is raining. It is so rainy outside. I'm in my gym kit, so hopefully myself to go. I've got my friend. She's borrowing some dresses for um, more importantly. Um, so I'm gonna go drop it off at her boyfriend's office. This thing in the middle is really annoying, but it's the only way I can hold everything. Um, I can't even do it on here. I think I just keep walking past her. I'm like, Gonna get a match first. Feeling like I, I've got like a tickly throat. Ah. And I always get ill as soon as I'm about to go away, which is the most frustrating thing, anyway.
somehow managed to end up at the Arsenal Stadium. Mm. Pens and tobacco. Lactobaliculus or something. Anyway, that's a really good one, especially for like women to have. I'm excited. I really didn't think about this purchase. Am I confusing myself with doing this? But I was like, I want to make it not like I, I don't know. I want to make it not like blurry. Like even now, this iPhone's a little bit blurry. Anyway, so I just looked at loads of people on YouTube, and you know, like if they're doing a mirror shot, I like zoomed in. I was like. I think it's this one. Basically, it was free because I didn't know I had the money. Anyway. Okay, that's not as thick as I thought it was gonna be. But I got a new notepad. I feel like I've not been doing my gratitude and sort of journaling. And I honestly think my life just goes mental if I don't do that or like have some kind of like, I'm not very, very present if I don't do that. And I think that, although when I first started, I was like, oh, what is going to be like writing that? Like, I can't bloody spell. I hate writing, or like, I thought I hated writing from like school. Try it. <laughs> oh my god. It's got a really lovely, like, almost. It's a gel. I don't think it's a gel, but it's like an illuminating primer, and it is really, really good. I've been using that. I don't want to break this. Oh, oh. Ooh. <gasps> yeah. I've been wanting to do a smoky eye. <laughs> and I don't have eyeshadow, so that's perfect. Anyway, I'm oh it's nice and sunny on that side. I'm gonna get in the shower, wash my hair. Cause it is gross. Also, I used to use, I went through a stage cause my hair started falling out. Um, it's a story for another time. Anyway, recently I just went back to just like my old shampoo and conditioner, which like years ago, when my hair, like my hair was so long. Can I put a picture here? This was round COVID, so it hadn't been cut, but it was like thick. It wasn't like straggly. This is what I've been using. It's pretty good, recyclable as well, and L'Oreal. <laughs> Love you guys. I wanted to show you is we use this. Ooh, it's sunny. I use this, as you can see, I am literally on the last end to take my makeup off. It's like a balm, cleansing balm, to take the first layer off. And then I used to just go in with this. And I do like this, but I didn't feel like it, when you're double cleansing, like you still need the second one to cleansing your skin, taking your makeup off, and then you've got to cleanse the your actual skin. Okay, so boring. I just got this one and it's really good. It's for very, very dry skin. Very dry and this is very, very dry. Foamy oil cleanser and I used to be not a fan of anything oil because it would I feel like I was like oil equaled breakout. And I think that's just because I had a few bad situations with like essential oils and things like that which can irritate your skin anyway this says suitable for babies so it's very gentle it's not gonna be annoying three ceramides it pretty much looks exactly the same as this like ingredients wise but it's got oil and it foam you feel like clean i feel like that tiger grass has lasted quite well i mean the spots but they're not they're not aggravated. I'm gonna use my aloe scrub. It smells so good. If you don't know what dry brushing is, you get to know. I feel like everyone should dry brush. This is a dry brush. It just looks like one of those, like, um, you know when you're a baby and you get your nails done. Or well, your lymphatic system mainly, but also like helps rejuvenate your skin. Good for cellulite, good for circulation. Basically. <laughs> I'll show you, I'll be a model. Want everything to flow to your heart and your lymph nodes, so you've got lymph nodes all here. You've got lymph nodes here, all the way down your back. You've got lymph nodes on your lower hips, back of your knees, back of your ankles. To take the brush, one, two, 
three. It slightly feels like it's like grating your skin off, but not in a, but not really. It doesn't hurt, and after a while, you can't really feel it. But it should be a bit, it shouldn't be soft, like the bristles should stay. And then I use, and you can use this on all your body, and it's kind of like more a lymphatic tool. So kind of a gua sha, but for your face. No, for your body instead of your face. Same that I would do with the brush. And this is after shower, dry brush before shower. This is after. And then you're literally putting all the lovely oils in. You do that, and oh, you can do this. The glazing milk. Snail mucin. Reordered it because I just forgot about it for a while, and I don't know why because it's so good. 100% squalene. Mix that with any moisturizer, whichever one I'm using, unless it's already got squalene in it. A little bit more around there. This is probably why I run out of it so much. There is a dog who barks every single day, and I wonder to myself, it can you hear it? It's so whiny. I wonder, I initially was like, what the fuck is that noise? Why does it, why is it always barking? And I was like, poor dog, it's obviously barking because it's like slightly distressed or like being left at home. It's every day. Sleeping now. Do some work and I'm gonna open this up. Okay. I love how it's sunny outside. Woohoo! I make a toast for curry. This thing. They're always good to delicious the Ella for her stuff because they're also really good and they're just not like it's a salad. You vegan. Um it's actually quite nice, like really good stuff, not quite nice. I haven't opened my camera yet, so you'll still 